y'all look at what I have cooking today. Whoo! Hey, I'm Jamie Dean, and we're cooking up sawmill gravy, sausage white gravy off for our biscuits. I'm gonna show you how easy it is. But we browned off some sausage here. Now, all you need to make a good roux, that's what we're gonna start with today is a roux, equal parts fat to flour. Now, this is our drippings from the sausage. This is probably two tablespoons. So to this, I'm gonna add two tablespoons of flour. And I'm gonna give this a good mix. Now, you wanna get the crunchies off the bottom of the pan. Crunchies are also known as flavor, y'all. Around. We want this to be nice and brown. This is a traditional roux. Bobby and I learned how to make one from Miss Teeva down in New Orleans. And this is the base to a lot of delicious wet recipes. It's a simple roux. It's flour and fat, equal parts. Give this a couple of minutes to brown up. You really want this to thicken up. This is going to give us the body of our sauce that we're making. I can't hardly talk y'all, my mouth is watering because I love white gravy with sausage on biscuits. I've let this go, this is looking pretty good. To this, I'm gonna add back my sausage. You can add your milk now, but I like to add my sausage just to get all that flavor in there for as long as I can. I'm gonna get this covered up. How many days in my life did my mama have a pan of this going in the kitchen when I was growing up? Enough to keep my pants tight, I'll tell you that. I'm gonna add a little bit of milk to this. And this is gonna cook down. Now I'm gonna add, the roux is really gonna thicken this milk up as it cooks. This is gonna take a few minutes and I just made another adjustment over here on our finished sauce. Cause this really tightens up. So if you step away for a minute and you come back when it's time to eat and you find it's a little thick, you can just go straight milk a little bit. You know what, I'm gonna add just a touch in here. Don't be intimidated by a roux, y'all. I can't spell it, but I can make it, and if I can do it, you can too. That's what starts this beautiful dish, one of my favorites. The only thing missing is a plate full of biscuits. Oh, look. Boy, Heidi, I tell you what, this is country come to town. Thanks for checking back in, y'all. For more tips and recipes, go to PaulaDean.com. Mmm.